Are you sweeping? <gasps> sweep, sweep, sweep the floor. Can you go sweep the floor? I was sweeping the kitchen area last, or just a couple minutes ago while he was eating breakfast, and now he wants to sweep. Have at it. Although he's mostly sweeping the couch and the carpet. Good morning, guys. Today is gonna to be a fun day. It's still the weekend, and Anthony and I, after Gray takes his nap, we're gonna meet up with my sister and her fiance, and we're gonna go apple picking. And I'm really excited because Anthony and I, believe it or not, have never been apple picking before. <laughs> Grayson's got this, he's got this broom. Ah! Oh, good job, sweep the, sweep the couch, good job. So yeah, we don't really know what to do. My sister and her fiance have been before, so they'll show us what you do. And Alice wants to do a little photo shoot with Grayson, so I have to dress him up all cute today. Unfortunately, usually apple picking, you think fall weather and cooler, but it's supposed to be like 85 and sunny today. So we're gonna be wearing shorts, apple picking, but what can you do, it's Ohio. So we're excited to go apple picking. And Grayson loves apples, so I can see him just wanting to eat them. Whoa, all the time. Probably should have given him a baby broom because this thing is huge and it will whack me. Oh, geez. Yeah, that's not going to fit. Ooh. Oh, geez. I don't know if this was the smartest idea. <laughs> so last night, Anthony and I, usually on weekend nights, we watch a movie because I have a huge list of movies I want us to get through and if we don't watch it regularly, then the list just keeps growing because we don't have time to go to the movie theater anymore because we have Grayson. So we just wait until it comes out on DVD and then we find it for free online or rent it on Amazon. So last night we started watching the John Wick movies. The third one came out a while ago and Anthony and I had never seen one and two. So we watched um, the first one last night and it's, interesting it's just very action-packed but we were like if there's three movies and everybody loves it like there must be a reason let's watch it and it's literally about a guy who has his car stolen and they kill his dog and so he goes and gets revenge so interested to see where the second and third movie go but the first movie i mean it was all right it's just a lot of action not definitely not like a romance or comedy <laughs> but yeah so that's what we did last night let me turn it on. Oh, it is on. This is our new favorite game that we like to do. One, two, three. <laughs> Good job, Gray. Okay, ready? Do it again. Run, run, run. Run, 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 run. Definitely is getting his energy out before nap time. Ready? One, <laughs> two,
Yeah, ouch, we don't go in the street. Good morning, everyone. It's the next day. Yesterday was super fun. What is it? You want to race? One, two, Good morning guys. It is the day after when we went apple picking. We had so much fun yesterday with my sister and her fiance. Grayson was in apple heaven. He loves apples. He's eating one of the apples that we picked right now. He had so much fun. They said, um, they gave us like an option. You could have a small bag or a large bag and they had different prices. And then they said, be sure to, you know, eat a couple apples along the way as well. So that was super exciting because Gray loves apples. So he had several apples that he took bites out of. Um, we all had several apples. It was really good. It wasn't too busy. We were worried that it would be because it was a beautiful day and a weekend. So we thought it'd be kind of busy. There were some people there, but it was not as bad as we were expecting. So we're happy about that. What are you doing? all about racing these days. So yeah, we all had an awesome time. We found plenty of apples. It wasn't too busy. Um, so we were there for a good amount of time and then we paid and left and went and got some dinner. So that was really yummy. You want up in the swing? We're back in the swing, our favorite thing to do. So I'll probably just continue the vlog because um, I don't think I got too much footage yesterday. And we're not doing too much today, except in a little bit, we are gonna go to one of the libraries here in Columbus and they have Curious George coming to visit. I don't really know what that means. I'm assuming it means that they're gonna have somebody in a Curious George costume show up and people can take pictures and meet them. But I'm not exactly sure. The description doesn't give too much away. So I don't know. I'm assuming maybe they'll read a Curious George book. I really don't know. But we're going to go in a little bit and see what that's all about. So I'm sure I will record it if I can. Um, unless Grayson's being super clingy, then I won't. But I'm in the back because he seems to like it better when I'm behind him. <laughs> You'd think he'd want to look at me. Rude. supposed to be another hot week this week unfortunately um sorry I'm betting to pick up an apple that gray dropped it's supposed to be another super hot week not as hot like in the 90s but high 80s like all week and then I think this weekend's supposed to be hot too so is it fall yet it's like September 16th you would think it'd be fall but nope still hot still hot weather although if I remember right Last year we went and got Grayson's six month pictures done the first weekend of October and it was really hot. I remember we had on longs to make it look like it was fall, but it was really hot outside. So I guess I shouldn't be surprised, but every year I am. And we're just swinging. I feel like I'm the weatherman. I'm always telling you what it's supposed to be weather wise and how hot and everything, but I don't know, I find it interesting. Especially like if you're watching this and you're not in Ohio, you're in a different part of the U.S. or, or the world, maybe you want to know. Oh, is that a truck? Oh, what does the truck say?
We are back from going to go see Curious George at the library. It was super fun, but not what I was expecting. Um, I thought that they were just gonna bring him in a room and have like read a Curious George book and like talk about Curious George and then at the end like have people one by one go and take a picture with him, but it was not. This library that we went to, I've never been to it before. It was a little drive from our house. Excuse the llama in the background. <laughs> it's, it's keeping Grayson happy. But I've never been to this library before. It was the tiniest library I've ever been to. It had the smallest parking lot. So we had to end up parking like on a street nearby. So I had to like run carrying Grayson because we were already kind of late. We got there and it's the tiniest library. There's so many kids here to see Curious George. And they actually just ended up like breaking it, all the kids up into groups. So A, B, C, and D. And then once they called your group, you would get in a line. And then it was literally just Curious George sitting there. And then like one by one, you could go and like sit on his lap and like say hi. And that was it. So I really wasn't that impressed by it. I think they could have done more, but whatever. And I was also not impressed because, okay, I waited, like I knew the day you had to register before going to the event. So like the day of, like in the morning that you could register, I registered. So we had to have been like one of the first couple people to register. And they put us in the last group. They put us in group D. So we had to wait forever to go and see this monkey. Why is it, why didn't they do it like all the people who signed up first? Why weren't they not group A? Like I didn't understand that logic at all, but it was fine. They had like some puzzles, so Gray played with some puzzles. They had like little toys and stuff, but it was so packed because there were so many kids. They had like an arts and craft thing that you could make that had Cure George on it, but like Grayson's too young. He doesn't understand like how to make crafts. So he didn't do that. I just like tried to keep him busy until it was our turn to go see the monkey. He loved going to see it, which I was kind of nervous about because he hates, he hated Santa, but he liked the Easter bunny and he liked Curious George. So I'm just realizing that if it's like an animal, he's fine with it. But if it's something like real, like Santa, then he's probably not okay with. But he loved Curious George. He kept going, e e e e. Grayson, what does the monkey say? Yeah, he kept doing that the whole time. And once it was his turn, he ran up to Kier George and he gave Kier George a high five and then he sat and we got cute pictures and stuff. So that was good, but I don't know. It wasn't what I was thinking it was gonna be, but I mean, it's free. I can't complain too much. And then um, behind the library was a little park. So we went there and played for a little bit, but again, it was busy because there were so many kids. So then we just ended up going home, but it was something different, something to get us out of the house. So it was fun. Um, and I think that's about it. Uh, we don't have much more going on in the day. We're just, we're gonna go to the grocery store. I'm out of milk, which is bad. And um, I need like some other things and I need ingredients to make recipes for dinner this week. So we're gonna go. I've been doing laundry all day. And yeah, it's a hot, another hot day, 86. So I'm sure we'll have to go outside at some point, but. Right now we're just playing. Grayson's got this table. Oh, okay. But I think that's all for this vlog. So give this uh, video a, a thumbs up, like our channel. Um, it really does help. Subscribe if you wanna see more videos of cute little Grayson and our adventures. We've been up to a lot lately, so stay tuned because who knows what we'll be up to next. Um, but I'll see you guys later. Bye. Grayson, say bye-bye. You say bye-bye?